Welcome to Wanda's Work Basket for all things creative and crafty with a little bit of inspiration mixed in. Today's Wednesday, so it's What's in Wanda's Work Basket Wednesday. So, it looks like my basket is full today. Oh, okay. Today, I'm going to show you some things that you can use to store your drills or kit up your, um, your goodies that you can use while you're... Um, while you're diamond painting, these are from the dollar store. First, I have a suggestion. You know the little sleeves that tea bags come in. At least the um, my favorite tea, the Lipton tea, comes in these little sleeves. I keep these. I use them for the backs of junk journals, and I also use them to put um, the little bags when I'm doing it bag by bag. Let me move this back. When I am hitting up bag by bag, I use these to, to fit the drills in if I have a few. Some drills don't, um, some kits don't come with a whole lot of drills nowadays. Some come with a whole lot of drills. But this is one idea. I use this in storage too. I put rows of them in um, a box with the fit, flip lid, a, a fun little box, and I store drills, um, older drills in them. This is how the boxes come. Now I got two of them with one, two, three dividers. I'm sure that you're there here. With three dividers. And the way I use them, it comes with the lid but I put a rubber band around it to hold it secure. That's all. That's all I do. So the current kit I'm, I'm making, I have like <clears throat> from one lowest, uh, from one whatever to like, I have 666 is the last one in this um, block. I have 800 to uh, 9 in this one. Then I have all the 30 whatever thousands in the back. I have a couple in, in the front here that I haven't used yet in the painting, so I haven't put them in a little baggie. And then these baggies are ready to go to be stored with my extra drills if I, if I don't have a little bag already in there with the color, or if I have a color that it's a shade off. Um, I put the extra baggie in the bigger baggie then. But I'll show you that when I, when I <clears throat> talk about my storage system. Um, I got the idea from from Rachel at 4kids at 145 I believe is her um, is her site. She has a really neat video about kitting up and saving uh, your extra diamonds. Some people throw them out. I don't. I'm going to use them for little things later on and I'll show you that when I do that. But just dollar store. So little containers from the dollar store, and even ones that come in your tea pack. doesn't cost you anything, but you have some storage ideas um, that are cheap. Okay? <clears throat> Just remember that there is a contest going on. You, I have some prizes to give out. When we reach 100 subscribers is the first drawing, then 250, then 500, then uh, 1,000. So... Um, I will pick a name out of random from the comments on those videos. I will tell you which video will be the ones that I'll take the drawing from. So, uh, so you have to look out for that. One of the bigger ones is a, an, uh, whoops, not that one though. I have two of these, so I'm going to give you one, a hand turned pen. It's a shorty. As you can see, that is a different length than the full one and I love them. It's in purple mist, so this is exactly like the one you're going to get if you win that contest. And I also have a full, complete kit from Dreamer Designs, and I would be sending that out for one of the contest winners. So I am glad you stopped by. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment. Tell me how, um, what tips that you have for inexpensive storage, either kitting up or keeping your drills or um, other storage tips. Okay. Otherwise, I hope you have a fantastic week and I will see you soon. Bye.